Welcome to Everything Awesome Episode 2. Today we will be reviewing the Nerf Reflex Pistol, Just Dance 3 video game, and speculation of next generation consoles. We will start out with the Nerf Reflex Pistol. This is a cheap little pistol. It'll run you about five bucks. Comes in red, yellow, blue, and she has a distance of about 35 feet, which is about the same as the Raider and the Long Shot. It has a lot of power and works particularly well with suction cup darts, whistler darts, and velcro darts. I will show you how you shoot it. Put the dart in the front, it only holds about one, kind of a letdown. Cock this back, and then shoot. As you can see, that stuck to the wall and fell off. Um, for five bucks, I think this is a good gun, and I think that you shouldn't rely too heavily on it in battle, but um, I say it's a good buy. It's cheaper than the uh, Night Finder, which basically does the same thing and is just bigger and bulkier and costs more. Next, we will review Just Dance 3 video game. This comes for Xbox 360 Connect and Wii. It is a motion sensors, sensor game that focuses on modern dance. It features such, such hits as California Girls, Forget You, Party Rock Anthem, Dynamite, and um, artists such as Gwen Stefani, Lady Gaga, The Sugar Hill Gang, and a lot of good people, LMFAO. So. Um, on Wii, this will cost you about $30. On Xbox, this will cost you about $40. Xbox is the better version, uh, more accurate, connect, more fun. Um, what it looks like on the inside. Don't have the disc playing that right now. Uh, pretty easy to use. Don't really need to read anything. It's got an interesting gameplay with those neon colors and the characters, the funny facial expressions. Uh, really fun. Major improvements over Just Dance 2, like uh, the freestyle dance, which I love. So I'm going to give this about a 3 out of 5 stars. No, it deserves a 4 out of 5 stars. Yeah, so I like that. I think it's a good buy. Um, good birthday gift for someone. And now, on to our next topic. We'll be discussing the main idea. Next generation game consoles. At E3, we learned that we will be unveiling the next generation, the Wii U. It'll look a lot smoother, and it, for console, it's actually pretty sexy. And it will have a tablet-like thing that, to, to me, looks like it'll kill the DS, so that you can play games away from it. It looks pretty cool. We uh, know that this will have improved HD graphics, better processor, fast It'll be faster. They're trying to bring it up to the level of the PlayStation 3, I think. But, we're not too sure about the PlayStation 3 and the Xbox 360. The Xbox 360 says that they're, uh, they are um, currently designing prototypes for the next Xbox 360. Um, these prototypes include Xbox HD, Xbox 3D, Xbox Super, and Xbox 720. Now, I personally think that they'll either go with the Xbox HD or the Xbox 720. Either way, I think this will be a major improvement which will just frazzle your mind. They, they're saying that this next console will be Kinect based on low, they will come out with a new updated version of Kinect that will be much more accurate. As for PlayStation 3, um, in a note from Sony's leader, they said that they do not plan to come out with a new PlayStation for a couple of years and they say that their PlayStation 3 is good enough to last a couple more years so we will have to wait a couple more years. But as of right now, handheld games have already gone to the next generation. We have the Nintendo 3DS and the PlayStation Vita. I don't see too many improvements on it, but I, except on the PlayStation Vita, I like the graphics. Looks just as good as on the PlayStation 3. So, um, leave your comments. What do you think Xbox will do with their next console? HD, 720, 3D. Um, and I'll see you next time. Next time we will review an older game, Super Smash Bros. Brawl. Um, and some other fun stuff. So, see you later, guys.